I'm delighted to have been at Process Safety Solutions in WIC. This is the official opening of essentially a new facility for the company to expand its operations here in the Caithness economy to support its wider activities based and anchored around the Aberdeen economy. And what this gives the company is a great opportunity to recruit in the Caithness labour market with there is a high engineering skill base and links very closely to the college and to use that connection to support the company's business operations and it will lead to an expansion of employment over the next few years of up to 40 jobs which is a great boost to the Caithness economy. We originally started out as a safety system specialist. Uh, we support uh, safety systems on a lot of uh, offshore oil platforms. Uh, on, on the back of the systems work we have now developed our engineering resource so we offer now uh, control instrument engineering t for the industry including design and uh, feed studies all that sort of thing. We're pleased to be opening our office in WIC because we think we can add value to the local area and to recruit locally where there's a good skills base here uh, there's a lot of people currently commuting to work in Aberdeen what we want is to have 50, 100 engineers working out of our offices in WIC providing services to the oil and gas industry worldwide. What's important about this development by Process Safety Solutions is that it essentially opens up new employment opportunities here in the Caithness economy for people to tap into the wider energy developments within the, uh, within the north of Scotland. And for young people, there's the access to North Highland College to develop their skills through the modern apprenticeships. Um, that creates uh, great opportunities for young people to develop their skills and to remain here in Caithness to contribute to the local economy. And also there's the opportunity to work in a company like Process Safety Solutions where there's going to be clearly an expansion of employment over the next few years. So this is good news for the Caithness economy and great news for the young people of this community.